week is upon us yet again, folks. It is a very toasty day in July here in Austin, Texas, and it's time to make some spicy food. And in the past, I've heard a few people saying, it's not that bad, it's not that spicy. So, so today, I'm gonna give it everything I got. That's right, folks, today I'm gonna make the world's spiciest summer sausage. Starting with salt, black pepper, pink curing salt, never forget, white sugar, allspice, nutmeg, coriander, granulated garlic, yellow mustard seeds, our C-bind carrot fiber binder, and a little bit of some cayenne. Next up, our meat. So what I got here is one brisket sliced up and one pork butt sliced up, giving us 24 pounds of meat that I'm gonna stick in my freezer to get nice and cold. Next up, our liquid component, which is gonna start out with some of this stuff. The old Hitchhiker Extra Hot from Yellowbird here in Austin. Sounds good to me. In, oh God, that went right in my eye. It didn't. Luckily. Really wish I didn't just spray that all over my arm. And this is where things get really crazy. A little one million Scoville unit pepper extract. Oh, hope this doesn't hurt anybody. Oh, the color of that is death. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. That's why I'm wearing gloves, folks. You don't want to mess around with this stuff. It'll blind you and burn your skin. And we're going to finish out our weight with some water. That is a concoction you have to be very careful with. While well, I send this meat through, I've also got a big pile of habaneros that I'm going to be sending through, as well as some serranos. Because some men just like to watch the world burn. In we go with all these spices. I got to say, this meat mixer is definitely the best part about heat meat because I've made a lot of spicy sausages by hand. It really burns your arms, as well as our liquid death. Oh, it's so damn hot. Not a fan. Nice chub. Got all these logs on the old chud box out here, smoking away. Ooh, nice and smoky. Just got a small bit of charcoal and a big dense log in there while these beauties are hanging in here, getting some lovely color and some beautiful smoke. Aiming for an internal temperature of 150 degrees, keeping it as low as I can to make sure we get a lovely smoky flavor and a nice red hue. Once they reach 150, I'm gonna ice bath them, hang them up in my kitchen overnight, and then they'll be ready to go. Uh, this yeah. is Brad. He actually made the sausage. He made the summer sausage. Have you tried it? Yeah, it's really good. Is it hot? It's hot, but it's not like crazy. Actually, the sauce takes it over the edge. Yeah, I was really excited. So the crackers were, I just melted down some butter and put a bunch of spices in here, habanero powder, cayenne, cumin, I'm trying to get ones that are not cracked here. And then just kind of tossed them all in there. So these are firecrackers inspired by Blake Stoker. It's like a choo-choo train of spices. Yeah. Oh, that's a direct quote. One of them is a smoke chili crisp so it has like dehydrated onion sesame uh -huh. seeds yeah it's a three pepper cheese from boar's head mm -hmm. which tastes really good i was trying a bunch of cheeses over there at the deli counter at heb and they're like here you gotta try this one uh, we love heb they feature yellow bird <laughs> you can find us on the hot sauce aisle and the condiment aisle. <laughs> <laughs> only one drop out most people come during lunch i'm starting to see pain faces and people with a little bit of heartburn but they're yeah. holding on yeah. Yeah. The flavor on the pork. Wine might say yeah. they're addicted. Yeah. yeah. What's been the spiciest I mean, so far? Oh, oh, white chili. chili. It's right. early market. It's on my right now. This is a hog. This is a cauliflower burnt which I recommend using the mustard barbecue sauce with it. Pickles, jalapenos, beef cheeks, and sausage. So the summer sausage has hitchhiker in it. There's a spicy cheese kind of in between there, and these crackers are spicy too. Just think about it like a like spicy lunchable. Moment of truth, we are at Leroy and Lewis. It is Friday, day three of Heat Week. Time to see how hot that summer sausage is. Looks pretty good, like the presentation. I've made some beautiful firecrackers to go along with it, but now we're gonna see how the folks from Yellowbird really feel about super spicy summer sausage. Sure. Do you need a fork or are you gonna go hand? Uh, I mean, uh, if y'all are okay, I'm just gonna get, get in there with the hands. Now, I see you guys have pretty high heat tolerances at this point, yeah. right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm just sweating from the from okay. the temperature. Yeah, right, right. Will you hand me lemonade though? It's a beautiful oh my God, tray. It's so beautiful. You gotta build the tray. Yeah. Okay. Okay, together. <laughs> and you went with extra sauce. Extra sauce. Do you wanna cheers it? Oh yeah, let's cheers okay. it. Look at look at that little yeah. cheese sliver I got. Oh wait. Yeah. Oh you want a little cheese? Oh, get yeah. you a little cheese. Yeah, I do. Oh I gotta get a little more sauce on mine for the photo. Woo! Alright, this is gonna be unforgettable. <laughs> cheers. Okay. Mm. Probably. No, but they all I started like even if I wash them, they kind of oh, subdue and I have a scent to them. Oh boy. I already got dust. I usually play some. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> I swarm. <laughs> That's amazing. I, feel it I love it. That's so good. 
Yeah. That sausage is like. Oh, is it that smoke? Is that cracker dust? Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's I I feel that. I feel that. I love it. That started it's, in the throat. It's gonna move to the nose. Oh, I'm just really I'm this is like third eye opening up. Next level snack tray. Yeah, next level. Up. Next level lunchable. Yeah, the first bite is always nice. You get the flavor. Mm -hmm. Then once the heat starts going, then it's all done. Yeah. <laughs> it's so good though. I like how soft the sausage is. Yeah. The question I have it's easy is, to bite. Is this a multiple bite or is this a one bite? Woo! One bite. One bite snack. Is it really? It can't be I one bite. I dare you. One bite and you have to chew the whole thing. That's challenging. I'm, I'm the Biggest and luckily you've got all this barbecue to wash it down. Yeah! Woo. Are you going for the one bite? One bite challenge? I don't know if you should, but... One bite, everyone knows you should. Really? There you go. All thing? I don't thing. know. Whole Make thing. sure you have a napkin. <laughs> I'm already sweat. I am feeling that sauce. Yeah. I'm feeling it in my... Uh, behind you know, my eyes, actually. My <laughs> behind my eyeballs. Use your actual spike and put it on like a... In true lunchable form. <laughs> Just like mom used to make. <laughs> oh, well, so far. <laughs> no. That's how it starts. Yeah, you didn't extra sauce. It goes from like yeah. two, three, four, five. It just builds. It just keeps yeah. building. You gotta it's start. So I gotta start dabbing. This is this I'm is out of seven right do. now. <laughs> get a get a beef cheek to hold uh, you over. Yeah. This and then some. Uh, I, I, some I, I, I like that. That's no. ten. Yeah, I'm at ten. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so good. <laughs> mm, citrus and ice cream. Yeah, that's yeah. right. Yeah. 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 How's it going, Jimmy? Too bad. How are you? How's heat week been for you so far this year? Dude, third or the Wednesday? It was hotter. Yeah, I did not expect that at all. <laughs> How's it hot. comparing to the last few years? You've done them all, right? I've done them all. I don't know why. My wife keeps asking me. <laughs> Your butthole is burning every day, so yeah. Maybe next year we'll finally get that uh, that Tums sponsorship we've been after. We should get like hot ones to sponsor. Yeah. That would be a better one. Nice. And then for the instructions. <laughs> Just say the same to you. First day was pretty pretty rough in a good way. It hurt so good. And then yesterday was just delicious. I didn't think it was too uh, too spicy. All right. It was good. Yep. You want more? Instant burn. You want to put yep. some in the eyes yep. so you the have a twinkle in your eyes? Yeah, It's really good. Good, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, there <laughs> it comes. <laughs> One to ten, where, where would you rank it? On the heat? Heat-wise? Heat yeah. We give it like an eight. Right, it's great. Very Moving good. Up. Yeah. Go. yeah. All right, my God, it is. Everything was fantastic. The sausage was hot. Just the way I like it, the cheese had that little peppery kick too. Mm -hmm. The cracker had the fire in it. Oh, oh it was all really, really good, man. You Just seem alright. You're not too sweaty. You're not crying. So I'm not I am sweaty. Can you tell? <laughs> <laughs> but remember, I'm used to eating like that. My yeah. head's all sweaty. I mean, I love hot stuff. I mean, yeah, really yeah. enjoyed it. Really, really good job, man. Thank you. Awesome. Yeah, I'm a wimp. I just took a little bite and some on fire right now. I don't like it. <laughs> See, I, w I didn't know they had this heat week thing, you know. So I was yeah. telling myself, man, that's really hot. It's got a good bite. I like it. And he's like, yeah, they have this heat week thing here in Austin. I'm like, it's pretty cool. Man. Yeah, but no, it was really good. Really, awesome. really good. Actually, everything. I mean, the barracoa was just like awesome. The cabbage was good. The uh, pork hash. I was telling my son because I mean I've cooked whole hog and it always has like a distinct little flavor, right? Mm -hmm. And that meat had that. It was like you can tell it really was a whole hog that was cool. It yeah, just it was totally excellent. Totally, yeah. Really, really good. Man. Awesome. Well, thanks for Everything was awesome, guys. man. For sure, man. Appreciate good it. to be here. Good, good to see you again, man. 100 degrees in here, pit room. Halfway through heat week, we already did the agua chili. Scared a lot of people away with that one. We already did past Pompanella pork chop. We just finished all of the Chud's spicy habanero summer sausage. It was a collaboration with Yellowbird and it came out great. It's still really hot out here. We're not quite done with summer yet. We're not quite done with heat week yet. We still got two more dishes, but all the summer sausage is gone. Thank God. Barely holding.